that is a heretic, a sinner, you know what I mean, and somebody that's estranged from her society. It's appropriate for us to think that what is going on here with the Word of God incarnate, God who has become incarnate to save humanity, is that when he goes to this well, when he meets the Samaritan woman, he is meeting his bride. What does that mean? He is meeting somebody that is a heretic, a sinner, you know what I mean? And somebody that's estranged from her society. And what does he do? And so this is something that Father Tom talked about. He said there are many signs that occur in the Gospel of John, like the multiplication of the loaves, the healing of the man that was born blind from birth. St. John Chrysostom talks about how it was his, he, he, he thinks that the man didn't even have any eyes when he was born, and that the Lord actually made eyes for him and put them into his, so that he could see. And so, and he raises Lazarus from the dead. He changes the water into wine. There's all of these different signs in the Gospel of John. But he said, this sign that occurs with this Samaritan woman, he said, is perhaps one of the most 